Vicky here welcome to another thrift haul I'm gonna be showing you some stuff from Valley Village and also Plato's Closet so before I go ahead I just want to let you know how thrifting has changed for me in terms of how I go into the thrift store I definitely do not go in without a mask that's the law we have to enter all establishments with a mask nowadays and I don't go in without having my gloves. Like you're handling the carts, you're handling clothes. I'm still apprehensive about that. So I definitely wear my gloves. So just because these things have not been washed, I just wanted to show you guys before I did the wash. And um, I definitely made sure that I put my gloves on before so guys I hope you're doing well I am I am working from home still uh, and therefore I have my laptop right here keeping and I'm just deciding to take a break and I wanted to get these washed okay let's grab the stuff from Plato's closet so I was in an area that I'm not usually in so I visited their Plato's closet I usually do well there uh, if you're in Toronto it's in the Woodbridge area so I definitely was able to pick up a few things um, I forgot something upstairs that I did get to which I'll probably bring down so I got a pair of Joe jeans I've been looking for just plain jeans with no rips on it to replace because I found that I had way too many ripped jeans and it's not appropriate at all for everything so I wanted to get some that are like a lighter color I have a lot of dark ones without rips but I wanted something lighter in color and definitely this was um, a good buy at $18 so was really happy to get these these are 31s they're very fitted um, they don't come down to the ankle they're semi cropped and it has kind of like a distress edge and a high low distress edge so I really really like this and I thought for the price it was just good to grab because I was in the market for that got another one of these waffle tops that I have gotten one others at Plato's Closet. This is from Teeny, just with a boat neck waffle and just with that little um, hemline that's kind of curved. Really like that. These are really comfortable and I got this one in a small which I like. The other one that I have is oversized and I wear it quite a lot. It's great. It's cotton. It keeps you warm but it's not too heavy so I actually enjoy these a lot so I like the fact that I got an extra small I think which is still nice more fitted than the other one that I have and this was only $14 I got this bodysuit t-shirt bodysuit which I thought was really different it's actually from Free People, which you know is one of my favorite brands. So you can't go wrong with a basic color. The light is going in. Light's going in and out, guys. It's daytime and this place is facing south, but we never get light. Um, so yeah, this was cute. You know, you can't go wrong with uh, Free People. Like, I, it's one of my favorite brands, but it's not necessarily very affordable so when I can grab it at the thrift store at Plato's I definitely do and it just is a bodysuit I've never seen this style of a bodysuit before it's just t-shirt fabric with a fastening for underneath so it's a little bit looser this size was a large so I really like this so you can really um, have a tucked in look oh it has some really cute features here so it has this on the side it's almost like it it's almost like it's a little bit of a not a pocket but an inverted kind of slit enclosed slit and then it's has this hair which is like a woven finish here so this that's an added touch and that's why I like free people like the details you can't go wrong with I also grabbed this 
Um, this was also free people. It's their We The Free um, line. Uh, I think it's more casual and more loose. If it could get any more bohemian, <laughs> this is probably one of their styles. And it's just a great top high low top very floaty very cool for the summertime Although this I can see myself wearing with just some cut off shorts and this was a great price at ten dollars the other thing was ten dollars too so this is just like super like great prices so I really love the look of this and it has like um, like the join in here so love that. Another thing that I got was this turtleneck. Um, I'm kind of liking turtlenecks. Last winter I got a couple and I really love them. And this is also, this is Wilfred, not Free People, but it's really nice. I love the oatmeal color because it's very neutral and can go with a lot of things. I'll be returning to work pretty soon. Um, at least once or twice a week so with that being said you know this will kind of extend my wardrobe a little bit and the price on this was $14 so I was really happy with the prices that I paid I didn't have a coupon or anything in the back but it was fine by me I got another little piece here um, another one of those kind of waffle type shirts um, so this is from American Apparel so most of them were like brand names in my to me and this was like ten dollars in that neutral color I just noticed that I have mostly neutrals which works perfectly with what I have already but this is awesome from American pa Apparel nice quality great stretch and breathable cotton which is what I definitely love last but not least for clothing I got this gorgeous sweater from French Connection which is one of my all-time favorite brands which we don't carry their stores in Toronto anymore so I'm always happy when I grab something from them at the thrift store and it's really a really nice sweater it's v-neck it's a bit oversized it's in this beautiful tan color so it's a size large but I really love the hemline of it it's like a raw hemline but it has like a triangular hem front and back but it's off center so I really really like this I really should try and do uh, what do you call it show you guys when I wash it when it's on how it fits because I really really love the hemline I love that it's asymmetrical in terms of the hem and has that triangular edge so yeah this was great and it was only $14 so the last thing I got I need to grab from upstairs to so just hold on a second guys hold on so I looked out when I was leaving I actually saw um, some perfumes behind so I figured there were more high-end perfumes behind the counter and on a shelf behind them so I asked to look at them and there was this Chanel Chance um, which I've never really smelled before I never knew that I smelled it because I'm not into fragrances like that but I figured let me just ask the girl to see it and it smells so lovely I really really like it it's really like a fragrance a floral fragrance with definitely a musky hint at the back it's not necessarily floral all the way through but it definitely is a great fragrance at $30 I was really happy to pick it up and what I love about it is the size because it's not it's like a 50 mil I think it's 50 mils which I just I worked in the healthcare admin industry um, where I wasn't able to wear perfumes it was a 
fragrance free environment so definitely um, I wouldn't do it now because I'm still working in the public sector but at the same time I didn't get to use my perfumes as much as I wanted to but I had decided then that I wouldn't get that big bottles of perfumes because it takes me years to get through them so this was the ideal size there's still three quarters of it left and I got it for $30 so I know on a whole this is probably worth a whole lot more than that and um, so I went in there kind of looking for back to work stuff and so I found a few things um, that were mostly summery I didn't find a lot of things but I, what I found I actually liked so I found this old navy dress it's orange one of my favorite colors and it is definitely a bright orange. It's a, just a basic, one of their basic swing dresses, short swing dresses. So I definitely love this and it's so soft and comfy. It's that Jersey fabric that's very, very like weighted, but definitely a good um, length and a good texture. So it just nicely falls on you and moves. So this was, $14.99 which was a little bit pricey for Valley Village like who are you fooling and so I got that but then I did have a 20% off card because I had donated so that's what they give us for donating and I've been clearing up a lot of things guys I found this little container which I don't know why I got it but I like containers but what I love about it is that it's small and it's it's like plastic or like it's rubberized so it won't break if it falls not that I'm I've dropped things often but I just like the look of it it's orange and I like the rubberized finish on it and it was like five dollars and the last thing I got which I always kind of I'm drawn to denim skirts but I've always been drawn to like a long ankle length denim skirt which I could probably wear for fall and I was lucky enough to find um, one which was like really long and I just had ideas for this like I, I don't know exactly I've been looking on Pinterest as to how to style this but I kind of know what I'm gonna do with it anyway it's like an ankle length maxi Ralph Lauren um, medium dye denim skirt so I love the wash on it and it goes for miles like it's really really long um, this seems to be a really really good quality it's Ralph Lauren polo so definitely it is good quality and definitely it's something that I'm gonna do a lot with uh, where is I can't find my other glove I'll just wash my hands but yeah it's really great it has a front slip slit and um, so that will make it easier to move in it instead of it not having a split and it being like a hobble but I really like it I plan to probably I can wear a white t-shirt with it white shirt with it I can in the fall layer it with a sweater and a nice funky biker jacket